we often come across two processes which sound kind of similar but are different absorption and adsorption let's see what's the difference between absorption and adsorption Adsorption is a process of incorporation of atoms or molecules of a substance in one state into another substance of a different state. As you can see here, a liquid is falling on the solid and entering the solid through small pores on the surface of the solid. This is a process of absorption. The key point here is that both the substances should be in different states like liquid is absorbed by solid or gas can be absorbed in the liquid second point is that it's the volume phenomena meaning the liquid is entering the volume of solid instead of just staying on the surface of the solid so it is kind of entering the bulk phase of the solid or gas entering the bulk phase of the liquid Let's look at some examples of absorption. First is softening of a biscuit. If you take a biscuit and put it in open air, after some time you will see that the biscuit has become soft or soggy. It's because in air also water is present, so the biscuit absorbs the water from the air and stores it inside it. So if you touch the biscuit, you will not feel the water but it is actually absorbed inside the volume of the biscuit which is example of absorption second example you can see swelling of resins if you put resins in a water bowl and put it overnight you will see in the morning that your resins have swelled up it's because of a process known as osmosis which is basically the absorption of the water inside the resin through the permeable membrane of the resin which causes the resins to swell up adsorption is the process of adhesion of atoms or ions or molecules of a gas liquid or dissolved solid onto a surface of a solid as you can see here the liquids are falling on the surface of a solid but they are not able to enter the volume of the solid instead they are getting deposited on the surface of the solid so the key point here is that one of the substances should be solid because the molecules or atoms of gas liquid or the dissolved solid will adhere on a solid surface second point here is that it's a surface phenomena so all the other materials are liquid or gas or dissolved solid adheres only on the surface it cannot enter the bulk volume of the solid so it's a surface phenomena now let's see some examples of adsorption. First, you can see non-stick coating in pans. It is basically the adsorption of a solid on the surface of another solid. Here you have a material known as Teflon which is coated on the material of the pan which makes it non-stick. Second example you can see misty windows. Water molecules cling to the glass windows during the time of fog or misty winter. As some moisture is always present in the air, occasionally water molecules bounces against window and a small electric attraction make it stick there. So over time these molecules pile up and form droplets. When they become sufficiently heavy, the force of gravity becomes greater than the stickiness and the drop rolls down the glass. So this is basically a liquid adhered on the surface of a solid glass if you like this video kindly like and subscribe and keep watching for more interesting videos